What's that? Are we live? Okay, let's do it live. What's up, everyone? I'm Corny Phil, and uh, as you can see, I've paused time because I'm a wizard. But as you can also see, we're only four and a half hours away from our prison, and I've made a bunch of improvements. So, first thing I'm going to do, cut down the number of guards. We have four guards for eight prisoners. Should be plenty. As you can see, we're in negative cash flow, but because we still have money, we might be okay. Also, uh, this is where things get interesting. Um... Workshop has been unlocked, so let's get a let's get a workshop running. Now I don't like I said. Um, yeah, we'll we'll wait to designate that. Like I said, I don't know how this works, so we will have to find out. Workshop press. So we'll go two workshop presses and two workshop saws. And we'll see how much that generates. Um, at the same time, health is almost done. I've hired a psychologist, foreman, and accountant. So, um, except for uh, prepping the rest of these cells for ten grand, which I will do right now. Um, yeah, we're almost ready to go for this. This is this is an expensive new build. I'm not gonna lie. Like, it is on a like the only the only saving grace I have right now is that because I'm familiar with all the grants, I can actually manipulate it to make sure I get all the pieces and parts in time. Uh, I will be building a visitation center, hopefully this uh, this round. Uh, but first, my workmen need to finish laying that path. And. Uh, is that almost done? That is almost done. Good. As soon as health goes, we need to hire two doctors and build a medical ward for ten grand, which is going to be important. And in fact, we can actually just start building the medical ward. Uh, now, a medical ward requires beds, medical beds, which I'll just build two of them because that'll be plenty, and doctors. Uh, doctors about to be done, and it's done. Hooray! So let's get our two two doctors on staff here. And designate the room as a medical bay. Where is it? Infirmary. Oh, right. It has to uh, it has to detect that I actually have doctors before I can designate an infirmary. There we go. So that should do. As soon as those beds get installed, that'll be ten grand. So let's actually look at the uh, visitation center here. Visitation center requires indoors and a visitor table. Now, uh, I think what this is put in to do is kind of help with, like... Uh, help with the whole, like, um, prisoners always wanting to talk to family thing. Because they, they always had a family issue, and you could only use phone booths, really. So let's uh, spend a little money and check this out. Our cells are going in nicely, so with that done, we'll get another ten grand for that. And I want to see how this workshop works, so... Work faster, maggots. Little workman dudes are so slow. We might even be able to hire some extra guards. Yep, ten grand for that. That was the medical wing finishing. Very good, very good. Oh, snap. We probably should, uh... We'll just burn some money and make sure we're not going to have to worry about power for the next eon. Getting, uh, getting smarter there, building uh, the pipes a little differently. There we go. So that should be all the water and power hookups for those cells. Auto-saving, auto-saving, auto-saving. Dun-dun-dun-dun! Yay! Okay, so we're still waiting on this workshop. It's in progress, though. Here we go. So our visitor's room is finished. Very nice. Have to see how that plays out. Uh, our yard's a little less equipped than it was previously, but once again, that's because I'm being a little more conservative. Kitchen, we're only going with two chefs because the daily cash flow is affected by um, finance, workman wages, guard wages. As you can see, cost me a lot of money here. So, uh, oh shoot, these things power? Ooh. Well, good thing I ran a power out to here. There we go. Gotta power them. Prisoners arriving in two hours. I'm um, still trying to get our prisoner totals up to uh, 15 here. That shouldn't be hard because we should be able to just go whoop, 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 whoop. And uh, designate those two. Boom! Ten grand for that. Yay! Okay, so we're doing well now. Like, uh, we've got our prison running. we got a good-sized canteen, holding cell, infirmary. 
And see, this is one of those things that I didn't do right last time that I'm glad I could fix and show you guys now, is uh, how to um, get all the grants in with just the money provided and have enough money left over to do whatever you want. If you notice, uh, they actually changed how the cable works, so it looks like that now, which is kind of cool. Thank you. Uh, shout out to my roommate TJ for providing me a drink. I know you're out there. I know you watch my videos, even though you try to deny it. So, now that while we wait for my workman to finish, let's talk about Cherry Coke. Cherry Coke is amazing. Pay me my money, Coke. Ah, it's delicious. Okay, so an hour till prisoners arrive. So I think what we're going to do is this will be another day in the life of my prisoners. We're just going to go through a full day-night cycle. Got uh, everything powered now. So, um... Hmm. Now the question is, how much is this workshop going to generate? I've got a bunch of... You know what? You know what we're going to do? We're going we're gonna to put a couple more presses. You know, we're just going to spend our money here. We're going to get risky here. We're going to get a little risky. Being reckless right now. That's probably, I'm sure somebody, anyone else who's playing this game is like, that's not the most efficient way to build it, rabble, rabble, rabble. Well, you know what? Whatever. I never said I was perfect, I just said I'm a genius voice of a generation. So, now uh, another thing I noticed, laundry room. Laundry machine, laundry basket. We may have to build that somewhere. Here looks like a good spot, actually. Let's just build uh, right next to the visitor center little uh, laundry room action, because I think the laundry room also generates money. So, um... Let's put a regular door on it, because I don't think it'll matter. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to think of anything in a laundry room that would be, like, dangerous. Now, I'm, I'm thinking, like, you know, bleach is dangerous. You can make bombs and stuff out of all, all sorts of chemicals, but I feel like my guards should be on the ball about that. So I think we'll be okay. Oh, good, it's already... Oh, the prisoner grant came in. We got 800 for prisoners. Prisoners are arriving. Go work. There we go. So let's, uh, while they handle that, let's deal with the laundry situation here. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, just pointing at the morgue there. Yeah. Um, if things get hairy, we're gonna have to make a morgue or two. We'll get three washers. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. And uh, three baskets, and we'll see how that works. May add more, depending on how that works out. But uh, for now, we're just I, I think we're in good shape. Our workshop's up and running. Our yard's up and running. I think everything is set up. Famous last words. Everything is good. No. No, it's not. Okay, prisoners coming in. Oh, let's get a little in. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, yes. Finally, I get to show you guys. This guy's busted. What do you got here? Mr... Steven Potain, he needs to take a wee. Holy crap. He had some he had some wire on him. Well, he's in trouble. Let's see what he is sentenced. Sentenced to four years for violent crimes, including violent disorder, assault, and violent disorder. Family. He has a 20-year-old girlfriend. He's 19. Huh, go player. Mother's 43, father's 46. Seems normal. But yeah, not a good guy. He got a... Uh, he got some trouble. Okay, so now we have the saws. Now, this is dangerous. I feel like this is going to be incredibly dangerous. But hopefully... Oh, does it require water, you say? Well, I can I can arrange that. Let's see. Where is a good place to bring it from? Uh, not the most efficient way, I'm aware. Believe me. But what is... Such is life. Mmm. Hey... Need more drains. More drains. Alright, so, so far it looks like our prisoners are doing pretty good. Oh, that reminds me, I haven't set up their regimen yet. So, 7 a.m., we'll call that eat time. We'll give them a nice... Actually, no, we'll call 8 a.m. eat. 7 a.m. shower. Free time... Oh, oops. Free time... Till... Or, you know what? Work. Work till lunch. Yard. Work, work. Work. Free time before bed. That looks pretty reasonable. Got maybe, I get five hours of work out of them. That seems, that doesn't seem unreasonable. 
We got we got money to burn, so hopefully we can get our prisoners working on these workshop presses and stuff. Now, why aren't they working? Why aren't you working? Mm. Yeah. yeah, I've got work time set up. I don't know what it is. Oh well, maybe it's just maybe it's just buggy or something. We'll see. We will see, because this is going to be a pretty short let's play if I don't get uh, my cash flow up. we got eight prisoners arriving tomorrow. I have the cells for that, so... We shall s whoa, 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 whoa. Sirrah, sirrah. have to buy, spend more money on capacitors, because this prison is sucking power. Uh, hmm. Wow, this is shockingly not half bad right now. What are you doing? Sitting, comfort, family. I kind of want to see the visitation center in action too. Truth be told, I kind of want to see what uh what the score with that is. Oh well. All right. So they either don't want to work, or I don't have something set up right. In either case, oh well. We have we have some money to burn. We should be okay. Ah, uh, so... T -t 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 cooks. Looking good. What do we got? What do we got for lunch, guys? Potatoes and cabbage. The full course of every meal is potato and cabbage soup. Oh, man. What are we, a poor Russian uh, family here? Good lord. Ah, uh, that's not funny. I'm sorry. I apologize. Alright, so our holding cell's not being used. Kel Supris. Um, it's eat time. Okay. That's, this is actually good. We'll, uh... Follow our guys, uh... Everyone checked out clean. Why are my guards all... Go there. You, get in there. You, get in there. Good lord. See, I feel like the, one of the things that needs to be upgraded is the guards' AI. They need to be kind of following the prisoners around unless they're assigned to something, in my opinion. Because, I mean, that's kind of how guards in real prisons work, is that I assume a majority of them are kind of going with the prisoners like there's guys on the guard watch towers there's guys on each cell block there's also guys that sort of go with you know there's reaction to where the prisoners are so if the prisoners are eating there's guards in the canteen if their prisoners are sleeping there should presumably be guards in the sleeping area if prisoners are showering we let them be and that is filthy 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 let's see can we let's get a let's get a cleaning and groundskeeping crew going here as long as security. Cleaning and groundskeeping, janitors and gardeners will just keep my uh, facility looking beautiful. Very expensive, but I, I spare no expense for my prisoners. Here, you know what? Go away. Woo! Four dollars. We are making four dollars a day on our prison right now. We are... Excuse me. So good. Okay, so this guy... Let's Paul Holt. Two years for possession. Now oh, that's that's not even worth mentioning. Nine years for assault. Pled guilty. Dang. Trafficking and trafficking. Ex-wife, son, mother. Oh, it's kind of sad. It's a Twelve-year-old son. But trafficking. He's a dealer. Rioting. All right, this guy we need to keep an eye on because he uh he claims he didn't start the fire, but I'm pretty sure it was him. A microwave, sunglasses, a chair, anything. Wow. Wacko Jacko, you win the award for being the scariest dude here. Congratulations. Oops, what did I do? Oh lord, what did I do? Oh good, I was just not a safe. So what time is it? It's time for the yard. i put him out in the yard. Let's see what everyone wants to do here. I'll take another sip of this delicious cherry Coke. Pay me my money, Coke. I will go to Pepsi, so help me God. Okay, so, now the one good thing about this is that I've seen prison riots start in the yard a lot. Like, this is kind of a good area because all the prisoners are in one area. But three guards out here, that, there ain't going to be no riot. So, cleaning security. Wow, man, this is... I may have to build a second whole power grid just to handle this. Good lord. Got our laundry in our workshop, but it's not doing anything. Now, uh, we'll see after a yard. I think uh, at 4 o'clock it becomes work time. Let's see if they work. Does it? No, it's still yard. Okay, they get... Oh, yeah, they get two hours on the yard. So, uh, prisoners are just taking some time on the yard. Let's see. 
Seen him. Seen him. Manslaughter, perjury, and perjury. 18 years for manslaughter. Five for perjury. F double counts of perjury. I'm not... Comment section. How could you have two accounts of perjury on one, like, case? That seems a little silly. Seven years for rioting. Good lord. Aggrav aggravated vehicle theft. Uh, I assume that's GTA with a gun? Dang. Um, hmm. I really want to see you guys work and slave away. Are you exercising? Look at this guy running laps. Huff, 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 Look at him running laps. What are these two guys? These guys kind of scare me, truth be told. They're like just sitting here conversing. I don't like that. We're going to have to hire new pri guards soon because I don't want to do four, 16 prisoners with four guards, and that's what we're going to have tomorrow. Then we're going to have to look into cell block increases, which is going to be fun. Fun. Okay, how are we doing? White lights all around? Looks like it is. Yep, white lights all around. That's good. Oh, good. So, oops. Bureaucracy's done, which I think means I can, staff-wise, I can go... He needs an office, but I can get... Get a couple of janitors. Uh, now, janitors will run around the whole building keeping things clean, which is kind of... Yeah, see... Which, I mean, even though they're expensive and they put me back in debt, I mean, it's kind of worth it, to be truth be told, because I just, I don't like my prison being dirty. I'm sure it has a negative effect on my prisoner's mood. So, let me go into the regiment again real quick. Is this it? Work, free time, yard, shower, sleep, eat, nothing. Okay. Oh, I forgot to uh, increase meal quantity to high. I like, uh, I think that's one of the things that's uh, been really useful for my prisoner, or for my prison, is, uh, huh. They're not working. Work. Darn you. Okay, so as of right now, it appears that my prisoners are refusing to work. Uh, that really sucks because I'm kind of dependent on this money here. This money here to sort of uh, fund my prison. This is going to be a short uh, trip if I don't get that working soon. We'll see, though. Maybe it's just... Uh, maybe there's something I'm missing. Maybe they just don't want to work because they're all scum criminal scum or maybe i've done something wrong i'll have to research that but uh let's see what time is it uh, hmm nice uh seven o'clock let's see what's for dinner dinner's always good let's see what we got we got uh potatoes whoa is this not it, did that fridge not go in Oh, I thought I installed a fridge there. Oh no, it is there. It's just lagging. Okay, I thought I thought I thought for a second there that I wasn't it wasn't working, but I think it's just derping, which is okay. It's okay. So yeah, day in the life of my prison, losing money, but hopefully that'll. Uh, I mean, tomorrow when I get a new batch of prisoners, that'll be fixed, and I can expand span the spell block off that money probably. In fact, let's do that right now while our prisoners. Uh, don't work. Alright, so I, what I think I'll do is I'll go over like this. Up like this. In fact, if I do that, let's see what that ends up creating for me. Because then I... Obviously there'd be a door here. Or well, be a door right here to get to this section of the prison. Nah, it's not going to be big enough. Okay. This part I know about, so it's going to have to be like... What I'll probably do is take out the fence. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Just a real quick check on our prisoners. What are they doing? They're eating. He's tired. Oh, poor baby. Got bacon and... Uh... Oh, man, we don't have enough cooker or freezers that could be a problem oh well they're not working for me so i fail to see why i should uh worry about it okay so let's see one two three so the wall would have to be right here which is actually assuming i can get this to work actually kind of perfect because then i can go like this and just have a whole wing of cells back here 
And I think I think what I'll have to do once I fill this cell block is uh, I may have to stop prisoners because I can actually say I can't take any more prisoners for a bit, which will be good. But uh, this is a this is a long term build right here. I'm not gonna be able to do this right now. Oh, poo. So we'll just keep it simple and do that. Okay. And then on this side we can do probably something similar. But yeah, that'll be that'll be another episode, I think. Uh, I think we're gonna be winding down here as our prisoners get ready to go Betty by. Um, we're gonna wait till midnight though, because I think that's when I get paid. So we'll see if the workshop's updated or if they refused to work. Hmm. Makes me sad, because I, I feel like this is what needed to happen. The workshop and stuff makes more sense for the game, but at the same time, it's like, well, damn, how am I how am I supposed to, like, make a prison if I can't have any money, because I'm negative money? We will see. We will see tomorrow. Uh, let's see. It's just free time. Guys getting showers. Janitor cleaning. Very good. Very good. Yeah, so here's a, um, there you go, guys. Two episodes. I built a fully functional prison in Alpha 9. One family waiting to visit 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Well, that's not today, so you can uh, deal with it. Regimen. We'll increase the amount of work. Six hours a day. I mean, that's not much to ask, is it? Six hours a day? There we go. The drains are actually working now, keeping the water off the rest of my facility, which is nice. They all checked out. So where are they going? They're going to phone family. Okay, that's fine. Now let's see. What's 11? 11 is sleep. Yep. Good night. Daddy loves you. Every one of you murderous heathens. Okay, so the prisoners are going to bed. And I should just shut down for the night. Very good. Except for you. What the heck are you? You're not tired, though. Oh, Lord. Go to bed. Oh, poo. <sighs> he's not sleepy, so he's going to be a problem tomorrow morning. So let's wait till midnight, and then I'll call it here for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Like it if you like it. Subscribe if you want to see more. Um, this has uh, been a new build in the new Alpha 9 version. I still highly recommend this game. It's a great deal of fun. Uh, and this is how to get a, a fully functional 16-man prison with the money given, including laundry and workshops. So let's see what happens at midnight. Is it just going to... Yeah, I didn't, didn't make any money for my workshop, so... Am I missing something? We'll just do a quick pause here. I mean, got workshop press and workshops. I got the laundry stuff. I don't... Hmm. I don't know. Um, until next time, guys. Uh, thank you for watching, and see ya.